A cold front is expected to stall along the southeast coast into Wednesday, potentially forming a new low over the warm waters of the Gulf just offshore. I'm Fox Weather Meteorologist Haley Meyer. This system may move westward into the north central Gulf, where slow development is possible if it stays offshore. While tropical development appears unlikely, the National Hurricane Center is monitoring this and tagged it as an area to watch with a 10% chance of development over the next two days. Any development is expected to be broad and disorganized with no signs of quick strengthening. It will likely be trapped under a growing high pressure heat dome steering it westward across Florida and along the Gulf Coast. There are many similar limiting factors with this area to watch as there was with Invest 93L, which we had last week, like limited time over water, additional land interaction and steady wind shear. But even without becoming an organized storm, this low will bring tropical-like downpours from Florida to Louisiana, even into Texas, especially along the I-10 corridor from Tallahassee to New Orleans. Driving conditions could become really soggy by midweek and remain wet through Friday. Rainfall totals of 2 to 3 inches are possible along the northern Gulf Coast, with isolated flash flooding issues if heavy rain persists over the same area. This could be one of many examples that we'll be monitoring in the northern Gulf, with long-range models hinting at better chances of development uh, into very late July and early August. Be sure to drop your thoughts on this hurricane season below.